Okay, so in our level, we have, uh, you might see, I have a few camera actors. I have my, uh, these are giving me my different camera positions. I have my master camera, which is an off-world live cine cam. You can just use the wizard to create your cine cam. I've turned mine into a blueprint here. Uh, we'll get into that later. Uh, you can also use this panel on the left to drag in a cine cam. Um, but the reason we have just one, one live stream camera and a load of regular cine camera actors, see they're, see they're different there. Um, this is the off-world one. And this is just the regular Unreal one because we can't just have loads of cameras live streaming out, making render targets, sending them out all at the same time. So instead of creating a load of these cameras and then setting them to active or inactive when we want, uh, this method seems to be a really nice way to just get this cine camera to take on the location and rotation of these when we choose them to. So these are kind of just placeholders so we can see where we're putting it and this is just going to take the location on a button press. So uh, all we can do is let's, I've created a few obviously here but let's create a new one. Cine camera actor, drag that in and I'm going to pilot it so you can see exactly where we're making our view uh, and why don't we get a mu shot. So mu, mu angle, yeah wonderful. So now we can eject from there. Uh, let's rename this one Mew, Mew 2 oh, There we got Mew 2 shot, lovely. So now what we want to do, we want to go into our level blueprint, uh, blueprint, open level blueprint, and I've done it here already. So if you're a little familiar with blueprint, you could copy this. I've just done this for each camera actor, but let's do it again for demonstration's sake. You've got our master out, or you've got your, you got your streaming camera, you got your hour capture with your render target. You got that there. Uh, in our in our level blueprint, let's go right click and keep that context sensitive on, and you can have create a reference to BP Master Out. Will this be your off world live cine camera? So create that reference. So drag off of this and just go attach actor attach actor to actor. Um, so this master owl is going to be attached to another actor and it's going to be attached to its location, snap to target. You know, the rotation is going to snap its target and the scale is going to snap its target. Um, so yeah, it's taking on the location, taking on the rotation, taking on the scale. Uh, they're all not upscaled or downscaled, but because you don't really scale up cameras. So And then we need a parent actor for it to snap to. So this is going to be our Mewtwo camera. So we want it to snap to this point and take that shot. So click on that one, create a reference and put that in the parent actor. Now we need a uh, keyboard event to make this to make this happen. We need to press a key to make it happen. You can make it happen on any event you like, but we're gonna do it on a keyboard event just for now. So you just go five and keyboard events, five key. So that's the five key press. You can also search that uh, just by typing five key, that will come up. Uh, and then on pressed, it's gonna attach this to this. So if we play test it, Press five, we got the new shot. Amazing. So I've got one, two, three, four, five. Got it. all different shots that I can have. Here's my screenshot, etc. Um, you might notice I can move my camera around with my mouse. Uh, that is a slightly different way of uh, doing this, and that's why I've turned my camera into a blueprint, which will go into literally at the click of the next button of the next playlist of the Bauti series. You wanna you wanna know this bit. Serious. Serious stuff.